Hello everyone! Today I want to help you increase your FPS in Rust or at least make it much more stable and consistent. Rust is a game that can feel very different depending on your settings. Even with a good PC, FPS can drop hard because of wrong configurations, unnecessary launch options, or Windows settings that people usually ignore. Before we start, I want to say this quickly. False Advi showed my full in-game Rust graphics settings in a previous video. If I don't forget, I'll leave card or a link on the screen so you can check it out later. But don't worry, I'll still show the most important things here. Alright, let's start step by step. First of all, we are in Steam. This is something many people skip, but it actually helps more often than you think. I recommend either reinstalling Rust, or at least verifying the integrity of the game files. Sometimes files get corrupted after updates, crashes, or mods. And this alone can cause tutors, FPS drops, or long freezes. To do this, right-click Rust, go to Properties, Installed Files, and click Verify Integrity of Game Files. Let it finish, <laughs> it won't take long. Now let's talk about launch options, because this is very important. A lot of players copy huge lists of commands from old videos or random forums. And the problem is, many of those commands actually hurt your FPS, especially after recent Rust updates. So here's my advice, remove everything unnecessary. Leave only commands that do not affect graphics or rendering. For example, no log, hi. You can also keep simple gameplay related commands if you use them, but anything related to shadows, textures, or GPU tweaks, remove it. Less is better here. Next step, Foyki key control panel. This part is extremely important, so don't skip it. Open NVDA control panel, go to manage 3D settings and either set these options globally or specifically for Rust. Set everything exactly like I show in the video. Power management mode, texture filtering, low latency, all of that matters. One setting related to disk usage is optional. You can enable it if you want, but it's not mandatory. Everything else should match my configuration. Now we move on to Windows settings, another thing people often ignore. Go to Windows Graphics Settings. Find Rust in the list of applications. If it's not there, add Rust manually. Then set it to High Performance. This forces Windows to use your dedicated GPU instead of power saving modes. This alone can fix random FPS drops on some systems. Almost done, last step, go back to Steam, open the Rust folder, find Rust Client, right click it, and open Properties. Go to Compatibility and disable Full Screen Optimizations this setting can cause input lag, microstutters and unstable FPS in some games, and Rust is one of them, apply the changes. And that's it! You don't need shady programs, registry tweaks, or fake FPS boosters. Just clean settings, correct configuration, and a bit of patience. I hope this helped you get smoother gameplay and more stable FPS in Rust. If it did, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. It really helps a lot. Good luck in Rust, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.